to the families. General Patton said, let's not mourn the men that we've lost, but let's thank God that these men lived. And that's what we're here to do today, to thank God that these men and women shared their lives with their communities, with their fellow officers, with their fellow firefighters. It, it's, it's, this industry is a family. I sit here today and I, I look out at the honorable retired sergeant from Coral Springs, Bob Behan. 40 years ago, our fathers served together in New York City. This, is, uh, this industry, it's a brotherhood, it's a sisterhood. We will never, never forget what the men and women that are gonna be honored uh, here today, what they did and what they meant to this county and to their families. The great tennis player, Arthur Ashe, he said, true heroism is remarkably sober, very undramatic. True he heroism is not the urge to surpass all others at whatever cost, but the urge to serve others at whatever cost. What greater service could the men and women have done that we honor here today have done, but have given the ultimate sacrifice? As the monument says, all gave some, these men and women gave all. We'll miss them forever. They were great, they were heroes. They stood for everything right in this country. Unfortunately, these are the men and women that are not written about, tend to write about uh, where, where a weak man stumbled. And that happens in, in law enforcement. It sure does. But by what, 1% of the people? The people that we honor here today, they're law enforcement. They're, they're the fiber of this country. As I turn the program on and op, uh, over to honor these men and women, I'll say this to all the families, their song has, en their song has ended, but their melody is forever. Thank you.